Hello there, Bradley from BRAD TV here, and today I want to give you a tour of my gym bag. I'm talking about this not to say this is what you should have in your bag, it's not like a video for beginners or to tell anyone what, it's just this is me, I want to share a bit more of myself on here. You might look at this, you might get some ideas, you might think that's stupid, whatever, put what you think down in the comments. Number one, you need a good gym bag. Waterproof, sturdy, got a shoulder strap because I can always carry it like that. Lovely jubbly. As you can see, it's wet because I've been to the gym this morning already. It was raining, and so inside's a bit of a mock up of what I normally have. Sometimes I hold it by these handles, not all the time. Good, sturdy zip. The top opens up like that. So, yeah, really good gym bag. I got it in the sale, I think it was 25, reduced from like 60 or 70 or something. So, for 25 quid, getting a real sturdy, super dry bag. And what it's made from as well. It's not cotton, it's like some real heavy duty, indestructible plastic. It, I've had it for a few years and I don't look back. I'm not a huge super dry fan. I don't like the clothes so much because they're covered in labels. It looks like you've fallen into a vat of super dry bumper stickers, says the man with doom written across his tits. But the bag, a billion percent, if they, I don't know if they still do it, but this is the best gym bag I've ever had. I don't want it to die yet. Yeah. Top of the gym bag will be my gym kit. At the moment, I'm just rocking some basic Adidas shorts and a very nice Under Armour Project Rock vest that did have short sleeves on it, but I chopped them off with scissors just so my arms poke out. A bit more freeing and I can get a pump on and I can look at myself. The Iron Paradise Barbell Club, very happy with that Project Rock vest. Gym towel. There's showers at my gym. Um, I always shower after my workout. I don't want to like come home or walk home in dirty kits. Sometimes I've done that when needs must, but towel. I think there's shower gel at the gym in a little dispenser, but sometimes if that's not working, I'm not full. I've just got shower gel. What have I got? Lynx Gold. Go with the brand you can trust. Then I'll have my water bottle. I don't have my own one that I wash and rinse up because how on earth do you wash a water bottle? You can't get your, I don't know what I'm doing with that finger motion. Can't get your fingers in it. Uh, so I just buy these, say once a month I'll replace that. I'll go for this Aqua Carpatica one. It's always on, say, club card, get it for a quid, sometimes 90p. Just rinse it out, refill it. But initially, it's on the Carpathian Mountains. Vigo from Ghostbusters, Carpathian water. Then I'll have my protein shaker empty, because I've just been, but it's a bit wet. At the moment, I'm having a little bit of weight gain half a scoop of protein and then some creatine after my workout. Let's get rid of this. Then I've got two plastic bags. One of them is to put my wet towel in and the other one is to put my dirty socks and pants that I've had on during my workout in that bag. The gym kit, once it's used, just goes on top at the end to sort of let it air and not touch anything. And then of course, clean socks and pants because the ones I turn up in, I'll train in them and clean socks and pants. Gym shoes, nothing fancy. I've got very basic Slazinger black trainers. I tend to do them up quite tight when I work out. I think they were £20 or £25 in Sports Direct. Just black trainers. Then I've got, I always have a spray. I don't rely on this outside. I've got roll-on deodorant, but this is one I got in like a Christmas gift thing, Ted Baker. And I just put this on, spray a little bit before the workout, just in case in the gym, because there's nothing worse than stinky fuckers in the gym. And then I spray it on afterwards, just as a little backup. Then I have my two leg braces, my knee braces, patella support. I haven't really spoken about my life altering leg injury on YouTube very much, but yeah, it was a good few years ago, in and out of a wheelchair, had to learn to walk again, in case you wonder why I'm not squatting and deadlifting every day, which I've started doing. I've always done my own leg stuff, but they are for my knees. I don't wear them for every workout. I only wear them when I'm actually training legs and lower back and core, when I'm using like a lot more of my entire body. I try not to use them on chest day, back day and shoulder day, just so my knees get strong. But I mean, always on my feet, doesn't affect me today, just there's no point running or doing big mega weight on my knees. Then I have my elbow grip, which I only have on my right elbow because last year I had a wrist injury then adversely affected my right elbow. So when I'm doing any upper body stuff, basically chest, back and then shoulders and arms in there, I'll have that on my right elbow and it really helped and the issue's pretty much gone, but I still use it. A side little pocket up here, there's a little awesome net pocket, pocket up there. Roll on deodorant, um, I swear by that, I don't know how people function 
I'm just spray deodorant. So I always have used a roll-on deodorant and I always smell bloody lovely. Padlock for the gym. Emergency tissues in case I've got to blow my nose. Uh, the final thing I've got is a little sort of toiletry bag. I got this on Amazon. Um, this just has my bits that I take into the gym. I think it's about five quid. Rather than spending a load of money on like a, a sort of a, a designer one, this was I just typed toiletry bag on Amazon. Again, tissues just in case. And then I've got my wrist straps. And wrist wraps. I started using about a year ago after my, my wrist injury and then I've actually got my little workouts that I've got written up and laminated and I've just written all my workouts on here waterproof bendy indestructible yes and that's an empty gym bag what is in your gym bag what do you think of what's in my gym bag I've got to put all this back in my gym bag thanks for watching I might be doing more silly little videos like this look after yourselves take care and be rad